Hey everyone, today I've got a really fun and easy, simple activity on how to draw a really cool seagull on the beach. So you need your colouring in pencils and your textures and some paper and I'll show you how it's done. Okay, to draw this seagull. We're going to start with his head. So we're just going to draw a curving shape over from the top. Like this. Okay, let's put a wing in. We're just going to do a long, pointy, kind of overly shaped like this. Next, we're going to put in, let's go back to the head and put in a beak. It's a long shape with a point. I'm going to put another shape underneath this. And let's put in an eye. Okay, let's put in a little chin. And then we're going to bring a curving shape around. Two little bumps bring it up to make a body. Let's put a little tail feather on here. Let's come back, two little bumps, and bring it there. Now we better put some legs on. So let's do maybe four lines that come out like this from the little bumps. Let's put a little bump on the front of that line and bring some lines down like this to make the legs. And now for the feet, Let's just bring some lines out with some little wiggles. And we have a seagull's foot. Now, we want this seagull to be by the, by the beach, so we're going to put him on a, a log. So we're going to do a curving a round oval, long oval, and just join it through the middle. Now bring the edges down. And he's now sitting on a wooden log. Now, to make him look like he's at the sea, Let's put some waves in the background to stop at his body and we'll continue it the other side. And what about some more seagulls in the sky? Okay, for our flying seagulls, let's have one that's a long oval shape. Let's put a beak on. Let's put a tail on. Fan shape with some lines. And for the wings, just some long wings like this. And then we're going to colour the ends of them black. Let's do another one the other side. And don't forget an eye. Hmm, what about one sort of flying upside down? Let's do the same again. And put a beak on. An eye. A tail feather. And a wing. And maybe we could put the sun in the sky. And maybe one more little seagull flying away. We'll do this sideways. Let's do this shape this time. Let's put a little tail on. Maybe some wings. And a beak. And an eye. And now, let's colour our seagulls in. Okay, there we go. There's our cool picture of a seagull on the beach.